Today we're going to be talking about how to wire a solar panel array for an RV system. Uh, we're going to look at the differences between a parallel wiring configuration, a series wiring configuration, and a combination of both to keep our voltage and amperages within the accepted realm for our given pieces of equipment. So right here we have two examples of a charge controller that mediates the power made by your solar panels and takes that voltage and amperage and steps it up or steps it down for whatever needs you have in terms of your battery bank. So you'll see a couple numbers on these products. You're gonna see a 100 slash 30 or an example for a larger controller is a 150 slash 85. What these numbers are, are the maximum allowable voltage and amperage ratings of that product. The 100 on this controller is for a 100 volt max. The 100 volt max is in terms of your solar panel voltage coming into the input of the controller. That can never exceed 100 volts or you risk damaging your controller. Uh, when you get into the larger amperage controllers, the larger ones here, you'll see 150 in that voltage column. So it's allowing you to have a higher voltage, but still you cannot exceed that 150 volts without damaging the product. The second number, the 30 on this smaller 30 amp controller is just that. This is good for an output of 30 amps to your batteries. So at 12 volts, it's good for 30 amps. At 24, it's good for 30 amps, whatever it is, regardless. You have a maximum output on this controller of 30 amps and a maximum output on this one, similarly, is 85 amps. So uh, you need to size your controller correctly. Victron publishes the information for how much wattage can be handled by each controller and uh, you can get on their website and figure out for what size array that you're gonna have in total wattage, which one is correct for you. So make sure you're looking at that before anything else so you can properly size your controller for the total amount of solar wattage that you're gonna end up having for your system.